2011, we were celebrating Christmas, and my sister told me I had ugly socks. I happened to think that they were very cute. I liked them so much that I wore my capris so you could see my festive holiday socks. It wasn't the first time that she picked on the clothing that I wear. Her and I have a very different fashion sense, and that's okay. Fast forward one year, 2012, it's Christmas time, and my sister said, so I went shopping for your Christmas present, and I actually went online, and I typed in ugly socks to buy new socks for Christmas. And she got me this pair, and I'm like, I liked unicorns growing up. I thought they were kind of cute. <laughs> Y'all may not agree, apparently. So these were the socks, and this started this kind of thing that we had with socks. And over the next couple of years, I got a couple more socks. And it was the summer, or the fall of 2014, my, my husband called our handsome that he is. We were, we were talking, and you know how they give 25 days of Christmas? It's like, well, what if we did 25 days? 25 days now. 25 socks of Christmas. I said, all right, let's do 25 socks of Christmas. Came up with a hashtag and started posting on social media. Oh, look, I said, Rob had a brilliant idea. Hey, I put it in writing, huh? Yeah. Rob had a brilliant idea. And so I, I started my 25 socks of Christmas, and I've always had a lot of holiday socks. Mom and I would, would find the fun holiday socks, get them. And so I was able to go through, and I actually had different pair of holiday socks. Now, I did wear a pair of two of Harry Potter socks, but I figure if ABC Movie Channel can include Harry Potter as a county as a Christmas movie, then I could count them as Christmas socks. So I did my 25 socks for Christmas, but as the season ends, the socks had to go back in the holiday bag, Aww. and 2015 was there. But the interesting things were, the socks still seem to be on a lot of people's mind. Because they were sending me pictures of their socks. They were sending me pictures of the socks they saw while they were shopping. And then they were bringing me socks. And I'm like, people are, are thinking about socks. And they're thinking about me. There's, there's something to this. So in summer 2015, my husband and I were talking about these socks and we're like why don't we play a game and see how many pairs of socks that Tiffany has in her closet and so that was the game how many pairs of socks does Tiffany have in her closet and we have a hashtag to go with it hashtag Tiffany socks so that people could follow along and see what socks that I was wearing now there were a couple of rules to the game number one I can only wear each pair of socks once and people say Tiffany how do you know if you've worn those socks before or not. And so I was like really excited. I found a super cute little mini laundry basket. And so after I wore the socks and washed them, I didn't put them dirty, I would put them in a the little mini laundry basket. But guess what happened before too long? The mini laundry basket got full, so I started dumping them into a drawer in my nightstand. And that got full. And so then what I started doing is I took the plastic Target bags, and as the drawer got full, I would dump all of the socks into the plastic Target bag. The plastic Target bags would end up in my closet in the guest room. There's a lot of bags of socks in the closet in my guest room now. And so I, they, so I wear them, and then they get put away. That way I'm not tempted to wear them again, or I would forget. And actually, social media has been very helpful because I post every time I wear a new pair of socks. And that actually helps me keep track because I can go back to yesterday or the day before to see what pair am I on. So you might be wondering, why am I sitting up here talking about socks, other than the fact that I like socks, and it's my opinion, so I can do whatever I want. Um, man, that's not a good joke. <laughs> <laughs> but so, so here, here's what I started noticing. Something strange and magnificent started to happen. People were taking pictures of the socks they saw in the store and sending it to me. People were tagging me in sock posts on social media. And people were giving me socks like for Christmas and other times too. I actually found this graphic and I thought it was, it was brilliant. So excitement over receiving socks, childhood. Santa sucks, this is not a toy. <laughs> the teenagers, uh, I could use some socks I guess, but when you get to the, the adults, it's like holy gay socks. <laughs> so I do have to say this, 
videos. I was getting a lot of socks for Christmas, and I'm really into socks. But apparently, because I'm into socks, people think everybody in my family's into socks, and everybody in my family starts getting into socks. I mean, sorry, get, started getting socks, and you can see their look on their face, like Tiffany's into socks. <laughs> Bottom of my 
much. Socks, thank you so much for starting us on this journey. Thank you.